Intro. Do you know that air pollution causes more deaths than traffic accidents every year? Me neither. Not until my allergies got out of control. So I've built this. It's a CR box and it's changed the way I breathe. Section one. What is a CR box? A CR box is basically a homemade air purifier. It's done with filters and fans. So you put them all together in a box and then you have an air purifier. It was invented by Richard Corsi and Jim Rosento. Oh, I get the name now. CR box. So we can safely say that it's been tested and it works properly. It's not something that I just invented. I've just copied. So the benefits of a CR box are that it's cheaper than a commercial air purifier, that it can be more powerful depending on the fans that you put together or the fan that you put in the box and that it's been proven effective, like I said, because it was invented by two scientists and there are lots of studies regarding it. Section two, how did I do it? Since I'm in Europe, the filters are not the same as the IKEA one. And the box that I've made, it's not the typical one because the typical one has four filters and one big fan. But I've used five computer filters called Arctic P14 and two IKEA filters on the sides. The materials that I've used are cardboard, wood sheets, fans, the connectors and the charger and duct tape. That's pretty much everything. It took me around four or five hours because it was my first one. I made some mistakes. I had to redo it because I put the fans facing in instead of out. Learning is part of the process. If I had to build it again, I would choose maybe other materials because the cardboard is not that good and I would like to have it in like more uh, in a more stable box. I just made it useful. Maybe next time if I'm in the mood I make it beautiful. We'll see. Section three. Why do I need it? I'm allergic to everything. Almost everything. Food, animals, etc, 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 etc. During allergy season it's horrible for me. Like horrible. My throat itches, my eyes itch, I get congestion and many other things that allergic people have. Furthermore, indoor pollution is a thing. There are some stat statistics. I'll look them up and put them here, but it's bad for your health. So I want to have like a good indoor air because I'm indoor almost all day because I work from home, I sleep at home, I exercise at home. So it's a lot of things I do at home. I don't want to be breathing bad quality air. Section four, results. Honestly, my allergies have almost disappeared. When I turn on the filter, it's like magical, but it has to be constant. Sometimes I, I turn it off like right now and my allergies come back. You have to keep it 24 seven, but I don't like doing it. So I do it like 15 hours a day, more or less. And it's helped me a lot, mostly at night. I used to wake up many times at night and I don't wake up that often anymore thanks to the box. So we can say it's worked. Let me tell you a little bit more of it. It's super easy. It's very cheap to make. It's very cheap to maintain. Cost me around 90 euros to build. And then each time I replace the filters, it's gonna be like 26 euros. So it's not that bad. I checked it with a manufacturer one and the filters are way more expensive. It doesn't sound that much between 30 and 42 decibels, which is not that bad to be honest. And it's thanks to the fans that I've placed. If you build it with a bigger fan, it's gonna cause more noise. That's why I used computer fans because they are not that loud. Here you have a test of me using it. Sometimes the simplest DIY projects can change the way you live. I didn't expect this to make such a difference, but now I wouldn't go back. 